Well, good morning. Here we are in Ilkley. It's lovely and fresh this morning. Got a really autumnal feeling about it. Now, a resin driveway is really attractive, quite hard wearing, but they do have particular issues when it comes to cleaning them. Just like tarmac, they're quite prone to getting moss on them. Unlike tarmac, they really show off organic staining too. My name is Paul Driver and I'm the owner of Jet Ready. We're known for exterior cleaning and restoration services and we do an awful lot of driveways. So here we've got a south facing aspect but quite shady all the same because of this large tree. And down here by the back door, quite a high traffic area, we've got moss growing across the surface. And in this dark corner we've got even more moss. And running along this border by the shrubs we've got lots more biofilm. And this is where we've got dark coloured patchy discoloration. Now biofilm is an unwanted ecosystem of various different organisms. We're talking about algae, lichens, mould, fungi, bacteria and of course moss. And we've got all of that in this view here. Take here for example, lots of speckles of black lichen. So there's lots to do. Let's get started. So here's what I'm going to do in five simple steps. Firstly, because the biofilm's so bad, I'm going to treat the whole area with a deep clean foam. That'll fade a lot of that organic staining away, even before I've started cleaning. Secondly, I'm going to cut round the edges and get deep into the corners. Thirdly, I'm going to use my push along flat surface cleaner so I can get the whole area done relatively quickly. I'll be using a figure of eight motion with this so that I don't get tram lines. Number four, give the whole area a good rinse down. And number five, I'm going to cover the whole area with a biocide treatment. That'll kill any remaining organic growth and it'll also keep the whole area looking cleaner well into next year and probably beyond. I'm going to use my X-Jet device to put the spray down really quickly. Uh, right, we'll leave that to dwell on the surface for about half an hour.
that really is looking a lot better now. One last step, I'm going to put a biocide treatment over the whole surface. In this drum we've got a concentrated biocide solution. I'm using uh, Backclay Pro from Pure Silk Services. The active ingredient there is BAC, benzalkonium chloride. It's widely used as a disinfectant and it's absolutely perfect for exterior cleaning. It'll take any remaining biofilm that's on that driveway and just annihilate it. It'll be a long time before it comes back. I'm going to be applying the biocide with the chemical injector attached to the pressure washer. This has got a variable knob on it which allows me to um, vary the rate of dilution um, anywhere from fractions of 1% right up to nearly 50%, about 45% dilution. So it's really good for uh, sort of one to one type ratios as well. Great bit of kit, perfect for this type of application. Connect my high pressure out, I'm going to fit it in line here. I've calibrated this before so that I know what the settings need to be. So I'm going to turn the dial to the number eight position and I'm going to reduce the flow by 50% and I'm going to reduce the engine revs by 50% as well. That's going to give me about a 3% end dilution of neat biocide or about one in 30, which is what we need for applying to a, a ground floor surface. So I'll start the machine, when I go on trigger, you'll see the concentrate being drawn up the hose here. In some ways this works like an X-Jet, but rather than having those little plastic proportioners to control the dilution, it's done with a variable dial. Uh, full PPE. So I'm going to be applying this with a foaming nozzle, not strictly necessary, but it does add the advantage of creating a foam which shows me where I've covered and where I haven't. Right, there we go, all finished. Customers very happy, everything looking spick and span. And until the next job, all the best to all of you.